Momo's Tofu Scrambler. This scrambler has taken years off my skin, both inside and out. Yeah, my kind of tofu scrambler. I got my tofu, which I heavily colored with some anti-inflammatory organic turmeric, which makes it look exactly like scrambled eggs, but is 100% way healthier. You can see the lovely crispy potato chunks and some sliced pepper, onion. I got some guardian beef crumbles in there for added plant protein. This not only looks amazing, this tastes absolutely delicious as well. Everything in this dish is not only healthy, it's packed with plenty of protein. It will keep your whole body replenished and rejuvenated. So here's our ingredients. Okay, I got six organic russet potatoes, one organic green pepper, one organic onion, some non-GMO grape seed oil, one bag of plant-based Gardein crumbles, two containers of organic extra firm tofu, some organic turmeric, and organic garlic powder. So let's get started. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. We are going to chop up our potatoes now. Chop up your potatoes to about yay thick and throw in your strainer for rinsing. I got my cast iron skillet here. It's been in the oven while it was preheating. Just go ahead and throw the potatoes in. Grab your non-GMO grapeseed oil and just generously pour it over your potatoes. It's okay to be generous as this oil is healthy and it will crisp up your potatoes. Now go ahead and season your potatoes with some pink Himalayan salt. Pink salt contains over 84 minerals, so I use lots. And add a dash of black pepper if you want, or more. Go ahead and add your organic garlic powder. Go ahead and stir them potatoes. Make sure you stir in those seasonings and coat them with your grapeseed oil. Oven is preheated, toss them potatoes in. Go ahead and slice up your green pepper. Slice up your onion in skinny wedges. Go ahead and give them a good rinse. Time to pull out the potatoes. Be careful as it is super hot. Okay, it's been half an hour. Let's add the onions and peppers. Now I add these in half an hour later so they don't completely shrivel away since this dish can take some time. Add in a little more oil so the potatoes don't stick and also for a little extra crispiness. Go ahead and stir those onions and peppers in. Make sure they get coated with that great seed oil as well. Toss back in the oven for another 30 minutes. Now go ahead and grab one of your tofu containers and drain the water out of the container.
Go ahead and press your tofu with your tofu press or just use two small cutting boards like this. Squeeze all your water out like so. Do the same exact thing with tofu container number two. Add both containers of your pressed tofu into a large skillet. Keep tofu on low heat. Now let's add some anti-inflammatory organic turmeric. I like to add in a lot, not only for healthiness, but also to make it the color of scrambled eggs. Now take a potato mashing tool and break up your tofu with your mashing utensil. Now as you break up your tofu, you'll notice as the color meshes in with your tofu, the turmeric, it will resemble scrambled eggs. Since my tofu still looks like scrambled egg whites, I'm going to continue to add turmeric till it resembles the color of scrambled eggs. After desired color, cover and keep on low heat. Go ahead and add in half a bag of Gardein crumbles or if you're on an extra high protein diet, add the whole dang bag. Stir in your Gardein crumbles. I love the Gardein crumbles because they are flavorless and they will absorb your spices. So it's been 30 minutes, pull out your potatoes and stir them carefully, not to mush them. Back in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes. Go ahead and give your tofu and gardein crumble mixture a stir. Now let's make our rice in our rice cooker. Let's add two cups of rice. You're going to want to rinse the starch off your rice twice and then you're going to want to drain it. Now that your rice is washed and rinsed, we're going to add two cups of water to your rice cooker. Put back in rice base, cover, and press cook. So the potatoes are finally completely done, and so is the rice right on time with each other. Wow, get a good look at them golden potatoes with the peppers and onions. Took an hour and a half, but they sure do look great. Time to eat. Now let's get us some hot, fresh jasmine rice. Now top off that jasmine rice with some of that ageless tofu scrambler. Yum, look at that. Mm-hmm. Whenever I eat this, I always make sure I have two large bowls. Now that's what I'm talking about. 
Yum. Yeah, make your whole body ageless with this yummy tofu scrambler. Keep it young, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.